Hello guys again and welcome back to another unboxing, viewing and testing of this RAS Pro Smart Tail Light from Sunren Tech. We've got a team sync, we've got a brake warning, rod pump warning, full color selectable, light sensing and auto wake up. There is two units, one you can install it to your saddle or your seat post and the other to your helmet. And this is the saddle bracket that it will help you to install it to your saddle. Now let's see from the other side. Uh, and we've got a SYNC with a DI Pro GPS unit. This unit you need to buy it separately. This is the model SRBTL20. We'll get a connection Bluetooth 4, battery rechargeable Leon battery. Magnetic charging, charge time is 2 hours, work time it is 24 hours under red light flash mode and 46 hours under red light slow flash mode. You can download the app for iOS and Android devices. The app is the Sunren Sport, waterproof is IP68. Well, all that's nice. Let's open it to see what we got inside and how we can work with that. And of course we are going to install to our bike and work it at the night to see how much brightness it has. Here we can see the type A cable to the magnet charging cable. And inside we've got some other accessories. Now we've got one seat post mount one helmet pad and one seat post pad and we've got four o-rings they will help you to install them same it is end to the other device and of course we've got and the manual if you want to read it is your choice but let's take a look all the features of this product we are going to find out together Plus for stay with me until the end and we can see in the app. Nice. Now let's take a look at this smart tail light. Nice. Feels very nice to my hand, very premium. Here we can see the magnet to charge it, very easy. You don't need any type C or micro USB, just put it just like that. You can charge it from your power bank, from any USB type A. The on off switch you can synchronize this with multiple devices that's for is the team sync we've got 12 full color high brightness led it makes you fully visible both in the day and at the night rides we've got brake and pumps alerts ambient brightness direction auto synchronization devices connect directly within one group without app or internet safety matters more when you are biking that's for this smart tail light it will help you to ride more safety to our dangerous roads even when it's raining when it has a thin fog at the road that tail light it will manage other drivers to see you it is fully visible from behind you've got 270 degrees field of view visible near 1000 meter and that makes yourself fully visible to other car motorcycles now the brightness is sustained flash slow flash fire warm breathing double flash three flash comet and sos ras smart tail light is compatible with helmets this way it can be mounted much higher than an under seat light for improved visibility in the heavy traffic how to sing without controller Creates a wonderful identification for your cycle team without turning on up. As long as the group mates have set their RAS Pro under the same color and the same light mode, they sync with each other in just a few seconds. There are two team sync options, join freely or use team code. That means you've got your buddies, your girlfriend, your friends, your family, and you can travel, you can enjoy the safety and the security of this smart tail light by synchronize all that together, all that tail lights together and they are flashing, working, synchronize it together in the road. Giving warnings, building six axis gravity sensors allows the bike light to automatically switch to brake highlight when decelerating, warning people behind your bike just like a car. Pumping warning, when riding in a group, most of the cyclists do not have a good view of the road surface ahead. So it is important to announce 
bottles, glass, gravels and other hazards. Ambient brightness detections, integrated light sensors with the optimized algorithms, the RAS detects ambient brightness and turns on automatically while you are cycling through the bright tunnel or some dark places. Installation and mount is very easy and can be mounted on a seat post under saddle or even on a helmet. Saddle bracket, we've got it here and a saddle bracket. With these tie wraps, you can install it into your saddle and then you can turn that and it can lock very easy. And of course, you can unlock it. Take it out, charge it to your home. You don't need to bring your power into your bike and your power bank. Just take this, this out and you can charge it. Or you can install it wherever else you want. And of course, you can use that. This the rubber goes here. Or you can use this rubber, whatever is suitable for you. And then it's the same thing. You can lock it and unlock it. Okay, now let's download the Sunrun app from the Google Play or the iOS. Hello, we need to make a register. Nice, we need something to, uh, for our profile, the weight, the height, and the age. Hello, hello, and using the app, devices, add a new device, now let's turn it on by pressing this on off, and there it is, add a device, RAS Pro, start scanning, and there it is, color management, oh I like it, We've got so many colors that we can change our own pattern. What is your favorite color? Everything is here. <laughs> nice. Lighting mode, fire wound, breathing. Okay, let's add in that an SOS and triple facets. Select scenario road bite. Road bite, prone warning light. Braking, alert and light sensing, pumping alert. Light output settings. Oh, high, I love the high. Ender slip mode time. Ender slip mode time, that means when your bike is not in use after four minutes, the time that you will set up, it will turn off the smart tail light. Let's put it on three minutes. Femur upgrade, we don't have. Reset, of course, not need that. Into the list are RAS. Let's turn on and the other unit. And here we are, we can see into the other phone. How to team up. Let's put a password. And we need and the same password in here. Now we need to put it in the same color. Now let's say we need the comet. Let's take this all out. And are in the comet or the SOS. Yeah, you can see they are synchronized. Let's put the sustain it. Remove the SOS. And they are working together. Or the triple floss. And you can see they are working together. Now, of course, the scenario, it can be road bike or helmet is your choice, what you want to be each other or front warning light.
and if you want to turn off the device just push for 2 seconds and it will turn off. To turn it on just press 1 and it will turn on. If you want to change the lighting mode just press 1 but first add all the modes from the app then you will have the opportunity to change them manually. Now if you want to switch light color just uh, double click and they will change the color or rotate the device quickly and you can see it's changing color Nice. And the color suites in red, yellow, green, cyan, blue, purple and custom color in uh, sequence. Okay, and now if you want to charge them, that is the easy part. And of course into the app you can see and the charging percent and it will turn to green if it has been fully charged now I think it's time to move on to installation to my bike and then we're going to test it at the night to see how much brightness it has now for the installation we need the seat post bracket the seat post uh, pad and the o-rings pads goes here you can put it just like that it, and then by taking the o-rings you need two of these you can mount it in the plastics here that it has and another one and then you take the smart light rotate it and it will lock very easy process. Now to install the saddle bracket, it will go here. We've got these zip types. Pass it through this hole. Find the right position. And the same from the other side. Then you can cut these two zip types and you've got a lovely installation. Take your smart light and lock it. Now let's move on for testing. Brake warning, you can see it goes to solid red when it stops the bike immediately and then after a few seconds is flashing again and synchronized with the second tail light. You can manage to do both tail lights and uh, goes to solid red and again synchronized and flashing together. It is your choice. I have only put the one just to see uh, the differences. That is very good uh, option and is working every time. Here we can see the road pump warning, it goes to solid white and that's how it will inform the other person that is behind you, cars, uh, motorcycles, bikes, whatever. And you can see again, and every time it works 100%. I'm leaving my bike and after 30 seconds that I put on a sleep mode time, it will turn off my tail light. Of course you can change that and the maximum is uh, 10 minutes and you can see it stops now when i'm taking my bike it will resume and again both of them they will synchronize imagine that the one tail light you've got it into your helmet it is the same thing and now here you can enjoy all the colors this is my most loved part you can change this tail light whatever color you want definitely you will find out your favorite color and you will enjoy it
and of course you can install it into the front this uh, smart tail light detects ambient brightness and turns on automatically when you are cycling through the bridge tunnel or some dark places you can change that from the settings oh look these beautiful colors i like the blue i'm sure you will find out the best for you And now the lighting mode starting with SOS. Three flashes mode light. Comet mode light. Slow flash mode. Sustain mode. Double flash mode, flash mode, fire warm breathing mode. Well, guys, that was all about this Raz Pro Smart A light. And let me tell you what I like about them the brake warning, road pump warning, light sensing, auto wake up, team sing. Yeah, you are outside with your friends, with your family, and you've got the same lighting mode, the same color, so vivid, so brightness. And you've got so many colors that you can choose. I'm sure you're gonna find out the right one for you. And, guys, about the app, you need to update it. It is about three years now. It is the small things that make a product very good. And the app is the small thing that for me it is thumbs down. Well, overall you can check down below to the description all about this product, where you can find it, more features, more settings, how you can work with that. But I'm sure this video, it can cover all these things. And with all that guys, this is the end of the video. Thank you again for watching. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Like what you like my videos, your choice. Share this video, you never know who may need it. And hit the notification bell because more videos in the future are coming and you don't want to miss it. Have a nice and lovely day. Bye-bye.